See this little metric splitter. This is our son John. John, say hey. Hey. Um, anyway, we're trying to tape this top uh, line up and not sure if we're going to go just gray or blue with it. Trying to help him out since we're dropping paper. Some paper keep blowing because the wind's blowing. So. Coming along, and uh, we'll show y'all the other side of the bus here in a minute. We sort of done some special designs on it. We don't know how it's going to turn out. But anyway, um, just wanting everybody to see this part. Yeah, um, my boy John, he decided to uh, do the cross on the door. So I guess it. It may turn out all right, but we painted the outside blue, and then the inside was white, but it didn't really look that good to us. So we went dark gray with it, and then the stripe is lighter gray. And so it's gonna be like the other side, blue and gray stripe. We ran out of uh, school paper. <laughs> <laughs> so grandma had this paper and gave us. So it's a lot of taping and painting especially for amateurs but we believe it's going to look good um, i just wanted everybody to see what i do when um, i'm down here in sunnyside my father-in-law we live down that well my father-in-law lives down there on the end and we're you can see our RV, we've been taping on it down there. Kind of hard um, to see. It's probably kind of hard to see that. If you zoom in, you might see the donkeys. I need to cut this tree before they get up here. But anyway, look, um, just wanted everybody to see uh, what I do. I, I cut firewood, and there's two barbecue restaurants down here in Georgia that we sing at. And uh, two of them buy my uh, firewood. And, um, and as you can see, there's a lot of old wood here that... The landlord uh, lets me cut. Uh, he said as long as it's uh, dying off and dead, I can have it. So, praise God, I, I cut it and sell it while we're down here. And uh, we love our music so much that uh, um, we, we put all our money into that. Um, um, but we just I just wanted everybody to get a little glimpse of what I do while I'm down here, um, um, parked down here in Sunnyside, Georgia. But uh, little John, you want to get back up that way? I'm going to cut this little bitty one right here today. But later on, I'm going to get that one out of that tree right there. And those two over there, I'm going to drop. So there's plenty of wood out here that he's given me. And that over there is the neighbors. So that, that fella over there cut that wood. But anyway, little John, if you'll go on up the hill there. All right. We're going to cut this one.
Okay. Well, it ain't chicken, but it's Nathan made pasta. And it's pretty good. Nathan, my son, can cook real good. Uh, that's him videoing. He's a little camera shy, but we're trying to pull him out of that. But anyway, yeah, good luck with that. Uh, I've just been splitting some firewood, <laughs> and we'll show you all a clip of that in a minute. This is the trailer here. Some land. There's some donkeys that... This is good old Sunnyside, Georgia. ...live in that pasture over there behind that fence. Yep. Anyway. All right. I'll come back after I get done eating. <laughs> I have an electric log splitter, and for as much as I split wood, it works out. And um, I can split a log about this size if it's seasoned. I can split them bigger, but um, sometimes I, I don't like to do that most of the time. But yeah. anyway, um, um, that's what I'm doing today is I'm splitting wood for Mr. Dean at Dean's Barbecue down in Jonesboro, Georgia. And he's allowed to buy a load a week from me until we leave out for Tennessee in April. But um, anyway, just wanted to share this, show you this little metric splitter. to have dinner and we wanted to uh, include everybody and just uh, let you see our dinner tonight we're having just spaghetti. spaghetti and chicken spaghetti mm -hmm. chicken yeah. ground chicken spaghetti ground chicken spaghetti <laughs> so we, let's uh, thank the Lord Father thank you for this food thank you for this family and for your mercies that are new every morning thank you for everything that you've done Lord thank you for the vlog lord and i pray that you bless the folks that watch us father and i just give you praise honor and glory and i ask these things in the wonderful name of jesus and thanks for the food amen amen, amen. y'all dig in all righty